right, so far as we're in the hat for the next round, what does progress mean to you? Progress means to me is um, is redemption from the FC United game, really. Um, the game, it didn't matter who the game was today in terms of the FA Cup or it was a league game. I think a lot of people had a few question marks over us, including myself and the players. And I think today was a very good game in terms of we got into the hat, we kept a clean sheet, we've had chances again, as we have normally will. And, you know, fair play to Skem. You know, I know Broads and the gaff was a nice guy and he had a couple of opportunities in the first half where Cam's made two good saves. And, yeah, it was a good game. I think we could have made it a little bit, finished off a little bit quicker. Um, I do think if the pitch was a little bit slicker, I think we'd have played much better football, which, which I thought today was, was a great style of play. Yeah, so not a bad way to go into Tuesday night, a little bit of preparation for that? Yeah, it gives, as I said to the lads, like, it's, there's not much wrong in terms of, I'll defend these players, that they're the ones I bring in, and you know I'll stick to them, I'm loyal to them, um, as I always will be with the, with the group of people I've got. Uh, ultimately, we, we let the fans down against FC United uh, in certain aspects. You know, again, it could have been three all, four four, whatever you want to call it. But yet, yeah, we've had a you know, few people have left the club now. A uh, few people have come in and give that little bit of lift today. It felt like there was a little bit of bounce in the change room. Um, and yeah, and as I said, it's you know, we've just got to keep continuing to what we're doing. We we understand the fans' frustration at times, and we're not winning, and everybody wants to win. But you know, we know, we I know what I'm doing. Um, the players are very good football players at this football club, and to be questioned in terms of their desire and commitment. I won't accept that from anyone, uh, which is nonsense. Um, you know, and I'll stick in and defend from them. And if anyone's got a problem with the fans, then come and speak to me and I'll sit down and talk to you and, and show them exactly what they're all about. Uh, who stood out for you today in terms of performance? Because to us in the stands, it looked like there's some good players out there. I thought everybody to a man today was brilliant. The lads who come on, uh, Jordan Carroll was outstanding when he went into centre midfield. He's a young kid playing out of position at right wing back. Uh, the back three looks solid when we're in a back three. I know people don't think a back three is, is what they want to see, but ultimately I do. That's another clean sheet. And uh, yeah, there was some good performance. I thought Cy Lennigan was back to his best second half. He broke up everything. Uh, Bobby Grant, is he, he, that's the reason he's a scouser, he's an assistant manager. Uh, you just tell how he plays. He plays his heart on his sleeve, and I think he gives us a platform. And I'm, I'm absolutely buzzing for John Louis Akba. Um, what I heard against FC United wasn't acceptable. Um, and I couldn't wait for him to score a goal today. All right, um, Andy always did make his return back to the club. Uh, what do you make of his cameo today? Um, I'll probably have to send him back to Shawley, so I think he's had a bit of a stinker. Uh, now, Andy, Andy's brilliant. Andy's the type of person that he's infectious, he's horrible to play against. I don't know what he's going to do, so I don't know how they're going to work out how he's going to play. Um, and he was just... I, I, I love Andy to bits, and I, I'm grateful for Chorley for put in the seven days cleared or clearing his contract so he could play today and he adds to the group and there will be more people coming in if I, if I see fit. Right, thank you, I'll see you on Tuesday.